Hey guys, it's Vince, back in the shop, aka my garage. I do a lot of WebEx meetings because of COVID-19. Our worship services for the Church of Christ, which I belong to, has been broadcasted virtually. I've been using an Android TV box in order for us to be able to receive the broadcast. What's happened recently because of the number of connections to the WebStream meeting, the Android TV box disconnected me a few times which then I couldn't even get back on that said I went ahead and I bought a mini PC from Amazon and that's what we're unboxing for you today this is a mini PC model AK3 V, which is an Intel Celeron based machine, J4125. I purposely got the 8 gig RAM because I wanted to have more memory. It has 120 gigabyte hard drive, dual band Wi Fi. This is actually a 4K box. For all intents and purposes, I should be able to have a very stable web streaming session with this particular box. So let's go ahead and open it and see what it looks like on the inside. It, it does come with a nice box in itself right here. Whoop, gotta cut it and get the top off. Wow, okay, cool. Nicely packed, there it is right there. You can see it. It's got some foam on the side and then plastic. And here is the box itself. Okay, now we got a power brick right there. 12 volts, US connector, HDMI cable. So that's kind of cool. It comes with a bracket. Okay, so this is cool, and some screws. It should allow me to install this mini PC in the back of my monitor. You've got your sticker that says Intel inside because it's an Intel Celeron. In the back, the power button, a TF card slot, USB 1, 2, and USB 3. We have the port, that's where you would put your lock, an auxiliary microphone jack, LAN cable port for your network if you're gonna hardwire it. It actually can support up to two HDMI monitors, right? So they designed this mini PC to hook up onto an HD TV monitor, AKA your flat screen TV. And there's a fourth USB port right there and then where you would plug it in, that's your DC. On the side, this is interesting, they still have a VGA just in case you have a VGA monitor that you'd like to use. There's box, right? Very neat, very small. All right, it is 130 millimeters or 5.13 inches. That's the height. It's not even two inches uh, tall. I can't wait to try it out. I'll give it a shot here. I think we'll use it tonight and um, we'll give you guys a, a, an update. Uh, as to how this performs. So it's been about a week since I've had the mini PC and I've been able to use it through a few use cases. I was able to watch movies that are streaming from Netflix, YouTube. So far I've been really happy with the result. It did replace the center box. Day and night experience, the Intel Celeron processor is working well, the eight gigs of RAM is working well, the Windows 10 operating system is pretty stable. The real key here though is WebStream where there are over 100 connections. I'm good so far with 100 connections i'm gonna be attending uh one web stream that's going to be close to a few hundred maybe even a thousand connections i'll see how it performs then but out of curiosity i did run a uh, performance uh, application against this computer to see what i i would be getting and overall this pc is performing above expectations uh in the 84th percentile that means for every 100 Computers that have the same type of configuration and right, this ranks like 16. However, 3D gaming on this mini PC is a no-no. It's just not gonna perform well.
What can you do with this particular PC? It can certainly handle more than enough your emails, your web browsing, your audio and video playback. Basic computing stuff, this is more than enough. I purchased this primarily for attending web stream worship services. I have booked it up with a 1080p camera. In addition to that, I did use this particular remote. It's easy plug and play. I just take the USB dongle out and put it in. Windows 10 recognized this both as a keyboard and a mouse pad and I was off and running. And for the price that I paid for it this box was under $200 and I believe I had a coupon so it was barely 170 uh, if I'm not mistaken certainly well worth the purchase so far for what I need it for it is perfect thank you for watching the video this is Vince from Mobile Media Arts we'll see you soon bye <laughs>